He is considered the expert on Valley baseball history, so it's no surprise René Torres' collection is included in a special exhibit by the Smithsonian Museum's How Sports Shape America. Here's Rick Diaz with today's Con Mi Gente. It's at the UTRGV campus in Edinburgh, and it's called Hometown Teams, a traveling exhibit highlighting the power of local sports from around the country. We have the Smithsonian Traveling Exhibition, which really deals with the themes of sporting and, and sports and their impact on American uh, culture and small towns. I, I stand before you as, as uh, one who witnessed the game of baseball through the eyes of a, of a bad boy. An eight-year-old bad boy from Brownsville on a team coached by his father. And this was important to me because uh, I, I had not been beyond Olmito. In 1928, uh, Mission Grapefruiters um, uh, preparing for a game the, against the Samanito uh, Greyhounds, Mercedes Lions from 1922, Edinburgh Jenners. He started his collection, he says, when he picked up the local newspaper and it had a story of a semi-pro team from California. I said, we have so many stories, so much history, about baseball that somebody should be writing and collecting memorabilia from our own backyard. And that's how I started. Now his collection and research are extensive. And this jersey that you have here is a sample of a jersey used by the Laferia Bombers. They won 43 games straight without a loss. It was in 1918 that we first had the, uh, the first love affair, uh, I may say, with uh, with the flag and the, uh, the Star Spangled Banner. Edward Doubleday, inventor of baseball, came to Brownsville, Texas in 1846. That was during the U.S.-Mexico War. And after the, the war ended in 1848, uh, he was stationed at Fort Brown for a period of three months. In 1868, only three years removed from the Civil War, we have the first baseball game played in the Valley. And that was in Brownsville. The exhibit is located here on the second floor of the university library. But the exhibit will be up only through this Friday. It's a chance to relive Valley baseball history. Sports that help shape the Valley and Rene Torres, the Valley's baseball historian. Baseball then was not just a game. It was a way of life. For Channel 5 News, I'm Rick Diaz. Con mi gente.